Jesus, Jesus, but see me more, me so me see more. Ah, Jesus, Jesus, but see me more, me so me see more. Wa wote wa sunje wenu nya etse mi mo me so me tsini mo wa wote wa sunje wenu nya etse mi mo me so me tsini mo Jesus, Jesus, what's he mean more? Means a meeting more. Jesus, Jesus, what's he mean more?
to everybody i hope you can all hear me loud and clear. this is the chat room session with me daniel datson right here on facebook streams on facebook every sunday uh what i do is that i try to bring to you some very good friends of mine or people who have become friends of mine through the power of virtual technology and we get to connect i get to do um, or I get to initiate the conversation, talk to them about what they've been up to, their music, their ministry, their lives, and what have you. And you out there watching, I know you do well to, to go check out their stuff uh, as you hear us talk about it right here. And today I have some amazing people joining me. Last week it was just awesome. Last week I had uh, Mama Inestina Corny. Um, I also had... Um, uh, Jacqueline, uh, Jacqueline, oh, Jacqueline Opari. I hope that I, I hope I had the name right. And, um, uh, well, my goodness, I forgot his name. Forgive me for that. <laughs> but yeah, it was just good. So, but this week, um, I, I have, um, three wonderful, uh, you know, guests who have have just breezed into the landscape they've not just i think some of them has been one or two of them have been doing this for a while but i think commercially uh, they've they've just come onto the scene and they are doing they are doing good stuff and we want to find out a bit more about their lives and find out a bit more about their music and their journey as it were so if you are ready as a yam i think i have my First guest, uh, I will have the rest joining me later, but let me say hello to uh, Lizzie. Let me see. Um, uh, hi, Lizzie. Hi, hi, hi. How hi. are you? How are you? I'm fine. How are you too? Hey, I'm good. I'm good. Good, good, good to have you on here. <laughs> Thank you. How have you been? Ah, Grace is still keeping us. Yes, that is that had a word, grace. Um, and in the light of what is happening presently with all the lockdown and stuff, I know that the only thing that is keeping every one of us is grace. But but tell me, um, uh, so how how has the present situation uh, affected your your music ministry? Because I know you released. Uh, this track that I played not too long huh. ago, how yeah. has it affected you <laughs> from there? <laughs> uh, it's, 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 it's not been easy. But we can also say that um, because of what is happening, um, we won't praise our maker. Um, he made us to right. worship him. So in spite of everything. In fact, the Bible says that in all things, we should give thanks to God. So in the midst of this pandemic, we won't stay home and say, oh, this is what is happening. So let's wait. No, we will still worship God. Yeah, it's not going the way we all expect. But God is still working. God is still working. Mm -hmm. Reminds me of the song by Akese Brimpong that says that God is working and he's up to something. We we may yeah. not see, but yeah. but still we are trusting. Right, yeah. right, yeah. right. Good. Yeah. So let's, I mean, I really want to find out a lot about you today. I hope you are ready for me. Yeah, I am. I am. <laughs> good, 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 good. So talk to me. Let's start from... Let's from let's start from the very beginning. Um, okay. Did you always did you always 
you know, see yourself as doing music like you are doing now um, someday? Did you always see yourself as that? Oh, yeah. Um, I'll say I started music when I was in uh, Sunday school. And it didn't start okay. like a joke. Yeah, it didn't start like a joke. It was it was serious. So gradually we graduated to the senior choir. No, the youth choir first. And then we graduated to the senior choir. But I always knew mm. I was going to become a commercial musician because I mm. I used to follow these uh, groups, Daughters of Glorious Jesus, um, Tego Sisters, uh, what's the name? Stella Seal, then Stella Dugan. I used to sing their songs. Right. I used to like their presentation. I used to like, I, up till now, I like everything about them. So I knew... Yeah. Um, I was going to do something like this. As for that one, I knew, but I didn't know when. Okay. Aha! Uh -huh, I didn't know right. when until uh, I think I finished SS, and I was like, well, "Just let me try something." So with that one, it was just a trial. <laughs> and wow. uh, yeah, we just tried something. And it didn't go well because we just tried. We didn't know anything about music, so, uh, market-wise. So, hold on, let me. Uh -huh. hold on. Okay, hold on. So when when you say when you say try something, does it mean that um, you put out, you know, you you did the recording and put it out there in the public space? Yes. Is that what you did? Yes, after we, yes, we did a recording. We did a recording. Okay. Uh, uh -huh, but uh, it didn't go well because. You didn't even have the connection. You didn't know where to pass, you know. But um, it was a stepping stone. What? Yeah, it was a stepping stone. What was stone. the title of, of the, what was the title of this, the song? Or was it an album? The, what was the title the of title, it? The title was, I think, Okeka Keka. Okeka Keka Keka. Aha. So wow, that after was, that, yeah. That was a nice one. <laughs> <laughs> After that oh, one, one, I yeah, yeah, yeah. We I paused a bit and came out okay. again with Australbetty. Yeah, I came out again with Australbetty. When I came out with Australbetty, I was in level hundred, and I needed at the to, university. Yes, at the university, uh, I needed to choose one because. You know, as, as you progress, things get tougher. So that one too, I had to pause. After I brought Oslo Betty, I released Oslo Betty. I had to pause, mm. <clears throat> finish school. When I finished school too, marriage came in, started, you know, making babies. And I'm here. <laughs> yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah. Let's, let's go back. Let's go back. Let's go back to the Sunday school. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm interested in the Sunday school. So you okay. you mentioned that you started at the Sunday school. What was yeah. I remember? I I remember my Sunday. School. What what was your favorite scripture in Sunday school? Or do you remember some my... of the things that you used to do that <clears throat> used to get you quite excited and and stuff as, in Sunday school? Yeah, I I my favorite scripture was I think um Job five twelve. He disappointed that the devices of the crafty and blah 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 so that their hands could not achieve their enterprise you know that was my favorite my favorite scripture i used to pray with it as a child yeah i used to pray with that wow. scripture a lot but yeah 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 <laughs> yeah lizzie that was i should say i should say that was a very um, unusual, uh, unusually matured scripture for a Sunday school <laughs> child, because I mean, yes. you know, when I was in Sunday, when I was in Sunday school, when I was in Sunday school, the easiest scripture was you know, John, John, is it John ten thirty five? And Jesus wept, and you know, we would just be going. John three sixteen for God yeah. so loved the world. 
So for you to, oh my goodness. Yeah. So for you to be doing yeah. job and that kind of thing, my sister, yeah. man, that my, means that the my, anointing you know, was bubbling up right my, from you. My, my music teacher was very wild. You can't come and stand before him with John okay. 3, 16, and I and my father are one. He will not accept it. He pushed us to the wall, you know, wow. and that is what has brought some of us to this far. He really pushed us to the wall. And mm. you think, oh, this is too much for a young girl. But hey, he will force you to understand what is written there. Yeah. And, and it's, it's really um, shaping some of us. Some of us. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Wow. So um, let's let's do it with the Sunday school for a bit. So talk me through what is it? What are, what were the, some of the things that you were doing there? Were you kind of did you have a children's choir that you used to um, lead, or you know, were you was it because you know you were your music teacher discovered that you could sing, so you were encouraged to do a lot of singing? Tell me exactly how did the journey shape up for you in Sunday school? Okay, I'll, um, out of the Sunday school, they formed a children's, this children's choir. But we started the Sunday school, I think, for a while before they formed the children's choir. And in the children's choir, I discovered okay. that, oh, this is what I have. They all got to know that, no, this girl can do this. So, in fact, I was one of their lead singers. I was, and I remember I used to, I used to lead these songs uh songs like um here's the answer here's the answer here's the answer to your problem oh friend so we used to you know sing these songs in fact i'm even thinking of compiling some of these songs because even though they were sunday school or uh, whatever they are still powerful songs yeah yeah, and and that, I was that, that one of good. That good. yeah I was one of the appealers musically. I was one of the appealers. Um, they they couldn't go without or they couldn't do without some of us. We were doing very well. We gave in our all. We gave everything that we had. So today I advise people, some of the you know, some of the you that now that you are strong. Now that you are not married, now that you are single, this is the time that you can do something for God. Because the Bible says that, what, remember uh, thy, thy, thy creator in the days of thy youth. It doesn't mean that yes. you will die before. Yeah. But a time will come in your life that you can't do that. Those things, you can't do them anymore. Right now I'm married. I have faith. Mm. I've not been going for rehearsals the way I used to. You understand? Uh-huh. So right. whilst you're young That's and you are coming, just give in your all. Give everything. Wow, wow, wow. Liz, I'm going to come back to you and we'll explore the onward journey from there. Let me bring on us. Charles Etraco from Takradi. Uh, hello, Charles. Can you hear me? Hello, Charles. Hello, Charles. Can you hear me? Hello, Charles, can you hear me? Uh, it looks like Charles is struggling to hear. Hello, Charles, can you hear me? Can you, if I can, if you can hear me, can you indicate if you can hear me? Right, okay. Let, let, let me come back to you. It looks like, yes, um, yes, please. I can uh, hear Charles. You. Oh, you can hear me. Oh, my goodness. Okay. <laughs> I nearly, <laughs> all right. Okay, 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 okay. Um, Right, so Charles, um, welcome, welcome to 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 the chat with session Hello. this afternoon. Now, yeah, I can hear you very very well. So, Charles, talk to me. How how did this start for you? Because I know that thank you. You are yeah, you are you are into graphic designing. You are into creative stuff. How did it how did it start for yeah. you when it comes to music? Um, How did it start for you? It's something that is already yeah. in the family. It's it's, it's already okay. in the family. Yeah, my father is a music director. Um, my first brother is a music director. My my twin sisters, 
and like the music is already in, in my family. My mother was an auto singer um, where my father was the music director. I mean, so um, that is how it started. So uh, from infancy, I've been, I've been playing drums from infancy by the grace of God. And gradually I, I moved to different levels and I'm singing now. <laughs> mm. Wow, that's interesting. So, that's so you know, so you when you kind of um, discovered yourself as a child, you're, you're into a family of musicians and and Christian musicians at that, right? Yes, of course. Yeah. So tell me, how did that? Um, how did that reshape up your um, how you how did that shape up how you see things generally before you even veer into music? The reason why I'm asking is that you know, I mean, although most people who would be born in family of although most people will be born I into think... a family of music and stuff, they might go off the mm -hmm. things. So how did it shape up for mm -hmm. you what you see? Yeah, hello, Charles. Can you hear me? <laughs> okay, all right. Uh, I don't let's know how try and let me. Well, so sometimes the link is not good enough. Right, let me see. I think I've lost Charles. The link. Easy. Let me come back. To, um, let me come back to you. So, moving on from Sunday school, now you yeah. are in. Now you are. Yeah, so now you, you went to the university yeah. and you know you 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 still continue to do music. At the university, yeah. what in, what 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 was the influence like? Because I know I know that sometimes um you you get to uh, maybe as it were meet different people, different talent, di different talented people and um, other great singers. So, how how did that contribute to your your skill development? Um, at the university, I'll say I veered off. I veered off in the sense that I pursued banking and finance. And in the class where I found myself, there were there were no. I did. I think I was the only musician there. <laughs> <laughs> I was the only, yeah, I was the only musician there. Uh, there, 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 there was no nothing. There was, I mean, I was the only musician there, and it was, it was like you're the local champion there. You know, they hail you, you know, because you're there. They know you're the <laughs> only. <laughs> So there was no competition. There was no competition. But right. even in the university, I was still trying to, you know, build upon what, you know, um, God, had, God has embedded in me. I was still trying to, you know, um, get more songs, waiting on God, you know, aside schooling. Because I knew music is me. Yeah. And that is why after school, I'm still doing mm. music. Yeah. Yeah, music is me. Mm. You can do it. You know... Lizzie, Lizzie, most people who have been exposed to music, even from their infancy, will just stick mm -hmm. to church, okay? They will stick to church and they will just, you know, do music in church. At most, they may be invited to other churches or go on to crusades. But yeah. you got into recording very yeah. early. Yeah. How did that come about? Who introduced you? You got I'll into say, recording um, after SS, yeah, and then you yeah, yeah. My my music my music teacher in Sunday school by then he traveled to the US, so I was communicating with him and he was like, oh, he okay. wanted to record me. Aha! Uh -huh. So that is how I started, and he, and then he introduced me to um Kwamina Bilson, a Getty and Friends manager. So, um, we right. started the recording from there, and then well. It didn't end the way I expected, uh, so we paused there. So God came in again later, mm. and we had to, you know, go back to do what we've been dreaming of. So 
That is how it's been. That's how it's been, yeah. All right, okay. Let me see if, um, Charles, let me see if we your network is good now. Can you hear me, Charles? Yeah, I think it's cool now. <laughs> okay. Okay, it's cool now. Hello, let me say, friend. Well, hello, good afternoon to Francisca Nyama. Hello, Chester. Yeah, can you hello. hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Hello. How, how are you doing? I'm blessed, Daniel. Thanks very much for joining us. I'm good. Okay. Thanks very much for joining us this afternoon. Now, Cheska, I want to find out a bit. I want to find out a bit more uh, about your journey, how it started for you. I mean, Liz has told me that she started from Sunday school. Um, Charles mentioned that he was born into a family where the dad uh, was a music director, the mom was a singer, the sisters were singers. How is that story for you? How did you discover yourself as a singer? Oh, okay. Thank you very much. Uh, I greet everyone. I think I was late because of my network. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, you thank God. Right. I started uh, singing way back. Um, I remember my mom sent me to uh, this. I was a Pentecost member, actually. So my mom sent me to this prayer, okay. normal prayer, charismatic prayer. So when I went there, around class five, and uh, they were singing, and I, I had a passion to sing some because I used to be an athletic, a um, 100 meters runner. Yeah. But I told God, uh, Ooh, I don't okay. want how, okay. my, I don't want how my body, it's as if I was, I was not developing well. My breast was not coming, excuse me to say. All my parts were delaying him. So <laughs> I told God that uh, I want to, I mean, change. He, I want him to change certain things for me. My mom actually was a runner too. So I told my mom and he said, okay, then let's pray about it. So I joined the choir. In fact, I was not doing well at the start. So one pastor, I thank God for his life. Is a prophet Amwako uh, in Accra. So he advised me, okay. You you have to sing. I can see you can sing. So through him, he gave me that passion and I, I started singing. I think my first song, Tikuninkena, uh, hey, my area, that's South Africa song. Yeah. So I did it, but in fact, uh, it was bad. Yeah, I remember that song. I remember that song. Wow. He advised me to go on the singers. They were saying, I don't know how to sing. Why are they giving me opportunity to sing? But in fact, he didn't give up on me. I really appreciate him, you know. Wow. So uh, from class five, I joined the church. The, the church was last anointing ministry. The last anointing. So I was singing and... Uh, uh, in fact, singing, singing. So I, I found out that I was doing better. So, two thousand. Mm. I was in class five till now. I've been singing. It's 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 quite good. I mean, God has done well, and uh, oh. I'm not all that there, but I know God has done well. So I brought. Mm. I did a, I now did a I, uh, uh, I'm listening to you. Yeah, I'm saying I'm yeah, I'm saying that um it's quite exciting how all of you have very different stories. Although you all started from childhood, but the 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 parts and the stories are are just very very interesting, you know. So um upon denominator i sh i find out that now all of you are into sort of commercial music i mean liz has told me how her journey began as far as production is concerned like recording out there now charles and and cheska tell me and let me come to you first cheska whilst i'm with you i'll stay with you first and i'll go to charles tell me what motivated you to 
record and put the music out there? What, what really motivated you? Okay, uh, thank you. Uh, I was, um, let's say, I was doing this, going to this church to sing, going to that church to sing, and uh, a friend of mine, uh, let's say, I don't know how to put it, a loved one, introduced me to a studio, that he wanted to send me to studio. I had bugged okay. one and some people, but I had not gone myself. So he sent me to studio at Suejo, and uh, I started recording there. So me, I was not even, I was not into it when we were starting it. But uh, he gave me that assurance that I can do it. And when he went to the studio, the man said, wow, what much? It's about four years ago. Went four years ago. My song is four years ago. I did it four years ago, yes. And uh, it has been mm. there. But okay. when, yes, when I sang that song, I have about four songs. Now, that particular song, I, want, I brought it out because of what I went through. That's why I chose that one to come out first. Yes. Okay. Mm. Okay. Okay. Charles, what, what, what is the story for you? How did you get into recording? Um, uh, I think, I think um, what really oh, yeah, inspired me was the fact that I... I understand that whatever God gives us is for the people, it's not for us. So that is where the inspiration is from. Okay, so when, when, when you get the understanding that whatever God gives you is for the people and not for you, that is when you have to start. But in all, you still need to, you know, develop yourself from one place to the other. You cannot just say, I'm going to record because God has given me a gift. You still have to train yourself, hide, um, be in a secret place for a while, know what you are supposed to do before you do it. So basically, that's how it's supposed to be. But I, I'm really inspired by what um, the Holy Spirit told whatever he gives me for the people. And because of that, I go all out. Any, any, I, I don't care how much money I'm going to pay, I'll do it because it is not for me. It is for his people. So basically, that's it. Okay, okay, that's that's interesting. Um, let, let me now come to um, what I would say, three perspective. Lizzie, let me start with you. So you started, you know, you started recording, and I I know I've recorded myself, so I know that it's not it's not cheap to record. <laughs> it's yeah. quite expensive. Okay, yeah. so. Um, how has that yeah yeah how has that experience been like for you having to ex, you know put in resources go to the studio bring out songs and and you know pay money to promote it and that kind of thing <laughs> how has that experience been for you and and have you faced yeah. any challenges any difficulties yeah yeah and it's not been easy because previously the money you could have used to uh, maybe record an album now that money can only record one song which is the single uh -huh. oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and after that to the video previously hey now the video the prizes they mentioned the prices, the prices they quote, you're like, ah, am I in a different world or something? But you still want, there's something you still want to do, you know? So, hmm, it was a gradual process. Uh, we did the recording, okay. we waited, and then when we got, you know, a little cash, we went, we went on with a video. And with a promotion, some of the did they, not all of them, some of them, you give them money and they don't, they don't play the song. You know, it's, it's, it's very painful. You know, you brought a masterpiece. You give it to them. 
you add money to it, they will not play. <laughs> and the most painful aspect of it is that after maybe playing the song for three weeks, you call the person to check on him and he tells you that, hey, your money is finished though, so you have to come and top up. <laughs> or ask, ask, ask me if I'm, a, I'm, I'm operating a full station. Yeah, your money is finished. You have to come and top up. Where you've not even, you know, received a dime from what you are doing. You are just pumping and pumping and pumping, thinking that there is a smile at the end of the tunnel. So your motivation is that one day God will speak and you are doing God's work. The Bible says the blessings of God make it rich and added no sorrow. So you know that definitely God is going to speak. Now you give them the thing and they don't even encourage you. They discourage you. The song is good. I mean, production, perfect. Everything is on point. You give it to them and they tell you that your money is finished after three weeks. Now with a video. You send a video to a TV station. They tell you, oh, as for this place, we don't take money, but they take money. They will take money behind <laughs> closed doors. And then ah, you'll be there. You're not seeing the video on the TV. You call the person. The person tells you that, oh, management says that we shouldn't play new songs these days. We shouldn't uh, 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 play uh, new videos. They're giving us 13 videos to play. So they push yours aside. You ask yourself, what is happening to Ghana? And especially gospel musicians, they don't even respect us. Mm. You see the songs, they play secular songs, they promote the secular musicians. I'm not saying it's not good, it's good. That is what they want to do. But this is what we also want to do. Why do you want to discourage us? Mm. Is it a sin to, 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 to work for God? Is it a crime to work for God? And they make you mm. feel inferior for working for God. That is, that is, that is, it, it pisses me. That is, you know, they make you feel as if, as for you, you are, you are, you are, you are part of the many more. You know, you are part of the many more. And many more, you are part of them. Would, Whenever yeah. they mes mention gospel <laughs> musicians, you are, you are, as for you. But when it comes to secular, hey, they give in their best. They do whatever they, they can do to support them. Okay. And it's very, very painful. Mm. And you know, gospel well, musicians, we rather put right, okay, in more. On. We invest more. Yeah. 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 Ho hold on. Hold that on for me, Liz. I'm, I'm going to dwell on this part for a little while. Let me the reactions of Charles and Cheska. Uh, um, Charles and Cheska, is, it, is the experience the same for you two when it, when it comes to, you know, doing commercial uh, music and promoting it? Hmm. So you are based in Tampa. I mean, I mean, you see, that's radio. That's why you are radio. You are on Facebook, so speak your mind. Let me hear what you have to say. <laughs> <laughs> oh, for me, I, 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 I would say Takrade for Takrade. They've been really supportive. For the people I know, they've been supportive, very supportive. Okay, but I, I have. Um, I, I tried going to Accra and uh, um, to see, and I realized all of them needed money. Personally, I personally don't have anyone promoting it for me, you know. So I have to um, do all that. But at the end of the day, I, I don't have enough. So what I would have to do is to just stay, stay my somewhere. So if you think the song um, has an impact on you, and you feel like playing it there, then you play it. But if but God, God gives me money for that, then I'll probably do it. But I've not experienced where I've given money to one person. They have not experienced that. All, all people who took a song didn't take anything, but they played and, and it's in Takrade. So I really appreciate them for that. Yes. So for Takrade, mm. really supportive. Yeah. Mm. But I don't know of the um, part, part of right. the other place. Yeah. Okay, yeah, Cheska. I mean, I know this is your first single. Uh, the music is out there. Is 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 that your story as well? Have you had the um, encounter where you have to maybe take the song to a station and then you you know you are having that challenge where you need to 
pay some money and it's not being played. Is that is that the same for you? Oh yeah. What me I've not done video yet. I'm yet to do. I'm doing one or two. It's not easy. Yeah. I was just listening to him. I think even the audio that I have, when you go to this station, they will say, okay, bring it, but you need to bring something. But I think the radio station uh, I got, I know maybe that's where I used to be. So I don't know if I used to do live worship over there. So maybe that's why they were not saying like I should bring much. But they were playing the song though, but it's a radio station and it's not it's not big as radio stations in Accra, you know, right? So I think they said I should bring something okay. for the presenters who will play. Uh, yes, they call it Payu. And the, uh, the uh, I think Kasapa FM. I called them and a certain guy, he received me. He mm-hmm. uh, said I should bring something for him to give it to the people, like the radio presenters. But I think that uh, this thing, if you want to start doing this thing, you need to sit down and plan very well. Because if you don't take care, you spend a lot. Because we, that we are coming, we don't have people to support us now. So the little that we have, we are trying to bring it up. And we have so many musicians there. But if we, as my sister said, if we, we should have been uh, the secular music uh, people, you will see people coming out from somewhere that you didn't expect to help. But we, as we've taken that cross, we know that our God will not let it down. Though I believe that if you start something good, you see, your food will be a part of and a piano. But that's it. So I know that the little that we mm. have, I right. know God will lead us to, I mean, do what we are supposed to do because it's not our work, it's God's work. Yes. Mm. If we believe. Okay. Okay. Him, you mentioned. Yeah. I'm with you. Um, you you mentioned something, and I want to I want to pick up from that. You mentioned planning. I, Liz, I want to ask: um, Is it that for us as gospel musicians, especially the new upcoming ones, is it that you know when we set out to do this, we don't um, strategically plan how we're going to? put out our music, the, 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 the kind of stations that we need to... When I mentioned that, I mean, maybe stations that, that sort of align with the genre or the style of mm-hmm. music that we have done and um, maybe people that also... Stations that also believe in you as an artist and, are happy, and your music fits their playlist. That is it that we, we, we don't plan, and, and I'm asking this because I mean I I have been on both ends, so I always say that I can I can speak to these issues. I am a presenter as well as a recording artist. I've, I've produced music and I have been on radio at the other receiving and you know promoting other people's songs and stuff. It's sad. I mean, what that is very sad and is a serious situation. But then I I want us as musicians and on signed ones as that. Let's see how we can tackle this. Is that something that we don't set out to do from, from the beginning? That that gives all these stations and presenters the chance to sort of box set about? Is that something that we are not doing properly? Um, I think uh, the thing is, you have to bring out a good song, a good product. And we all know that good product sells by default. Once the thing is good, it will sell. Now you bring the thing out, you meet. I don't think it has to, I, I don't think it has something to do with the stations, but the presenters, some of them, not all of them, some of them, those we have, those we've approached, yeah. Now the person tells you that, oh, the song is good, is a masterpiece. Um, 
but you have to bring some money. Now you give the person the money. And then after three weeks, you realize that the push, the energy with which the person plays or promotes the song is going down. Now you call the person, oh, I'm just calling to mm. check on you. What is happening? These days, the thing is not going the way you started. And the person tells you that your money is mm. finished. Is it that you didn't plan? No, you planned. <laughs> when we were when 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 we, when we were doing when we, <laughs> when we were doing it, we knew we I had already spoken to Sha. Sha, this is what I'm coming to do. How are you going to do it? Um, what is the strategy? What do we need to do? I mean, where are the corners to pass? All of these, we did them. It's not as if we just started something. We knew we were going to the station. We knew we were going to, we knew the station is good. We knew the station is good. And despite media, for instance, big ups to them, they've been very, very supportive. They've been very supportive. Mm. Apart from despite media, all the stations, all the, uh, uh, most of the radio stations, okay. the presenters that we, 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 we came into <laughs> contact with, they just take your money and then they push the thing somewhere. And you've 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 listened to the song, you've played it. I mean, it's 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 not one of those songs. If I say oh, it's not one of those songs, you understand. I mean, we really invested in, in, in into this this project. Mm. And then they just take take the thing and within the first three weeks, they make you feel that okay. oh, they are on top of the game, they are playing, they are playing, and after three weeks they, they push it somewhere. It's like you can go to hell. They don't care. They've taken the money. And you don't even have a receipt to prove that you're giving them money. That is the sad aspect of it. So we plan. Most of us plan. <laughs> we plan before we come out. Yeah, we plan. Mm. But they don't help us. The support doesn't come. The support mm. doesn't come. It's like you are left alone. Hello. It's like you're on an island or something. You are on your own. I mean, the way when secular musicians release, you know, the push they give them, we don't get it as gospel musicians. So, we, you will struggle. Right. Ah! Okay. <laughs> right. Right. Okay. I mean, um, if you have just joined us, is the chat with session right here on live on Facebook. My name is Daniel. Um, like you can see, my guest today, Lizzie Ntiamwa, um, Francis Kenyama, goes by the um the, the the industry named Cheska and then the they are my guests they are all um new recording artists I should say I mean some of them are not that I mean from judging from the fact that they've been singing from infant they are not that new but when it comes to commercial music uh, they are quite new and we, we are trying to find out a little bit more about about them um now let me find out what sort of support have you all be receiving from your local churches because personally I, I say this that um one one area or one um bedrock of support to the gospel musician is the church or the major bedrock of support to the gospel musician is the local church because it is the yeah. church that sings the songs that you are inspired to do. It is the yeah. church that you 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 serve in. You know, it is the church literally that also um, uh, has the capacity to help you generate the revenue that you need. Because at the end of the day, if the if let's say if you have people in your church, your your church has hundred. Let's just use hundred members. If hundred members. Are in your church, and you know you release a, a single or whatever, um, and these hundred members, you know, the church decide that okay, everybody in the church support our sister with five Ghana CDs. Go and download their track or buy. Let her do a CD with a single. Let everyone just invest ten Ghana CDs in that 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 produce hundred CDs. Let everybody give you ten Ghana CDs for it. It's a thousand Ghana CDs that can um, sort of cushion you as far as your cost is concerned, and it can help you 
do extra things. It can help you pay for online distribution. Or what is the support that you have received from the church? Hmm. Let, let me start with you, Charles. Is there any support that you've received? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, support from church has been amazing. Yes, it has been amazing. Um, for me, I love what my church does, whether in, in financial or prayers or anything. As long as they are able to even respond to what I do, that, that is um, a support to me. Okay, so it's not necessarily giving you money to record or buying your CD, but them responding to your praise and your worship and they accept the fact that what you are doing is making impact in their lives is, 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 a, is a support to me. Okay, so for, for church, they've really been supportive. Yeah. For my side, that's what I okay. can say. Okay. Yeah. Right. Cheska, any, any, any for you? I mean, we've talking about radio presenters. So how about the local church? How, how, how has the church been supporting your case? Come again. Yeah, I was asking. I was asking if the local, if your local church has been support when it comes to um, helping you, maybe promoting your music or receiving the music and helping you, maybe make some some revenue. As far as has the, has the church been supportive? Oh no, no. And uh, I think my I released it during the lockdown. So I think um, okay. for sharing on Facebook and on the group, fine. But I think, you know, nowadays we are not in the normal days. That's what people will say. Uh, so yeah. that support has not yeah. been there. So it's me and God. Okay. But I know it's, it will be well. <laughs> it's you and God. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Lizzie, is it? Is it you and God <laughs> without the church? No, it's not me. And, it's not me and God. Uh, because we do a lot to help the church. Responding to my praise and worship right. doesn't mm -hmm. put food on my table. This is what I want to do. Mm. What can the church do to help me as an individual? Whatever it is, I do something to, you know, uh, benefit, I do something to benefit the church as well. I sing people, you know, give offerings, okay. you know, all these things, we do them. We help pastors to do deliverance we, with administration and all that. And then when it comes to helping me, you tell me that, oh, responding to my praise and worship alone is enough to push. Is that what I'll eat? No. The churches don't support us. Let's see it. They don't support us. When it comes to musicians, we're always on our own. Even on Facebook, they don't respond. Wow. All the friends I have who support me on Facebook are not from the church. Yet when they meet you in church, oh, hello, oh, I saw your thing. Oh, 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 glory be to God, glory. You see, some even they, know some even won't subscribe on Facebook, my sister. Yeah, they won't subscribe they, on Facebook, Facebook or YouTube. Let's, 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 let's not polish it. They it's don't true. care about us. We give it our own. They don't care about us. Yes. Whatever that but happens to you, outside, they don't care. You see, outside okay. like the secular music, they support themselves. I'm telling you. They support themselves. Hey, you see. You must get the support from within before you come and, you know, criticize some people. Your church is not supporting you. I personally, I haven't yeah. received any yeah, support my, from my church. I'm a member of my, 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 Bible my, my Church, church supports me. Wow. Hey, that is you. Let me talk about mine. I'm a member of Victory Bible Church International. You know, Victory Bible Church is very big. Very, very, very big. No support. Yeah. Is the individuals, yeah, it's, it's, yeah. you know, the individuals who support more small, um, if you are fortunate, but the church yeah. as a whole will get mm. it. And it's not only my church, all mm. the churches, 
Oh, the Catherine oh, okay. Oakley have been I think, I think, have, I think that's have, true. The church has a whole... I'm coming. I'm coming. They have... Yes. You say your, your church supports yes. you. So you, you, you keep it there. All the churches <laughs> in Ghana, they have good musicians there. They have people who can sing for yeah. God's presence to come. They mm -hmm. don't support them. The churches don't support us. All they need from us is to come for a rehearsal mm. and then sing for the following. When I was when I was a chorister, now I'm no more. I'm no more a chorister. Yes. When I was a chorister, you go mm -hmm. to church in the mm. morning. First service, you are there. Second service, you are there. By the time you go home, it's around four. A banker. What time are you going to iron? All these sacrifices, you do them. When it's time for them to give to you, hmm. that one they are giving to a human being. But when you have to give to them, you are giving to God. So don't yeah. even question what that thing is going to be used for. You see? You see? Hmm. 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 Uh, th this, this, I mean, it's, it's, this issue is a huge one. I mean, personally, I have, I have um, spoken about it or I've been outspoken as far as that this has been uh, this is concern for a while i i mean i've not posted on on facebook for, for about it for a, a little while because of some personal reasons but but when i when i i used to be on radio actively i was always um speaking about these things that if 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 for nothing at all right if you have if your church membership is about two to three hundred or even those for the large churches if everyone subscribes to your channel on YouTube, okay, huh. if everyone subscribes to your channel on YouTube, that alone will qualify you to monetize your video for you to get revenue to do what you are doing yeah. for God. Yeah. You understand? So yeah. it's, it's, it's quite, it's quite a, a, a serious issue. But then, but, I mean... But Uncle Dan, not everybody oh, is, is, is on is a social media person, so... Why are yeah, you defending so how do you them? I understand you. That's <laughs> the excuse that we make. Right? Uh -huh. Wait, so, uh, that is the excuse. That is the excuse that we make. But it will surprise you to know that all the, the you know the Christians and the church members you are saying are not huh. on social media. Let they can they know everything about Shatawale. They know everything about Sakodie. Yeah. They, they know everything about the. <laughs> they, they know everything that is going on in the secular world. How did they get to know? It's true. You know, they, are they, there. They, are, they know everything about Kofi They, know, they are there. They are there. They are supporting. You see them. Are no, you see them. Don't you, don't you, don't you read them I mean, on Facebook? Don't you see them on Facebook? Don't you see them posting things true, on Facebook? It's true. Don't you even see them? Why are you? Why, even why, why, why are you? It's true. Even why if they don't have... Why are you defending them? They will have a child I'm not, in I'm their not, house. I'm, I'm, that not, will I'm get not defending them. I'm not defending them. I'm not defending them. Even when you... When you want to lunch after you've gone to do all your things, so you want to lunch your thing in the church, they will tell you that you have to pay something. Yeah, are you in the auditorium? Oh, oh my god, yeah. <laughs> the churches, you have to pay something yeah. for you in the auditorium. Why are you yeah. scared to say yeah. it? It's going you have on. To write a letter. <laughs> no. It's going hmm. on. You must oh, say Lily. something. They've not, they've not contributed <laughs> anything to your pro, 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 uh, project. They've not done anything. Launching the thing hmm. in the auditorium, you have to pay something. It's true. Because you use light, right? <laughs> yes. So you use light. You use water. People wow. come and clean yeah. the, all the... So they, the church cannot do this just to support you. No. When it comes to the church... No, no, ah, no, they are not, not, in not, not all the church. Not all the church. It's, it's not. No, it's not all the church. Charles, so, Charles, Charles, you, Charles. I mean, just like, I, mean, I know your local church. You know, I know your pastor, and, and I know, I know, I know how supportive he is. So maybe for your, for you, mm -hmm. the story and the case is very different. For, for a lot of um, it's not like no, is it a, a no, maybe I think he himself, like he is close to the pastor, and maybe he's close to the pastor. Thank not, you. It's, the church is not all that no, no, big. No, 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 like no, 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 no,
I've, I've, I've really say. suffered. We suffered say. coming this far. I'm telling you. It was they will mind in you. Church, Dan, they will not mind you. Building before. They will mind you. Alone. They will not mind you. So, they will not me, mind you. you know, I think maybe what, he's what, close what? to the pastor. I mean, that's what it's, it, 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 it's very sad. You finish, no, you finish ministration, it's, it's and they are like, Oh, today powerful. you blessed us. Oh, oh today you did so you well. Oh, today was amazing. Oh. oh, you were all over. Meanwhile, you don't even know what you're going to eat. Okay, I have a message here. Yeah. No, is it? It's not like, wait, I have a message. Mm -hmm. Okay, wait. I have a mess. I have a message here, and um, there is a message for Abigail, Abigail Crown, and she's saying that people will subscribe to what they like. You can't fault them, and he's asking if is your music enjoyable to them and good quality. If yes, you don't need to force anyone to come. Um, I, 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 I disagree. I mean, I would say that that one. I, no I one is forcing anybody. Because no one mm. is forcing anybody. It's not forced. Yeah, As my I, sister is saying, I, I, it's I, not I, I also disagree. Yes, it's not what forced. What are we doing as a that church one, that one to, I would to, disagree. to project I would... the image of God? What are we doing as a church yeah. to project because the image of God? Because if you help and your by neighbor... by supporting each other. Yes. It's yes. by supporting each other. If you don't support each other, how do you expect to project the image of God the way you're supposed to? What is she trying to say? It's like evangelist standing outside to preach the gospel. There is nothing different from that. You know, if you can subscribe those people out there that, that is not saying, I mean, bringing people to Christ, fine. Singing about love is good. We are not saying it's not good. It's good. But you know that we are... I, I mean, these things that is happening right now, I see it to be the end of uh, the world. I mean, that is what I see. I take it to be like we are, we are in half time now. So you helping your neighbor or you helping your friend, your sister to send the gospel out there for people that are being heartbroken, uh, people that don't know God, to know that we have a God, it's, it's by force. No, it's not by force. It's your credit. It's your data. Mm. You choose what to do with it. For that one, yeah, it's not by force. Mm. It's not by force. And we're well, supposed to be a body I mean, of Christ, like, right? Like I was saying, yeah, I understand. <laughs> I mean, if we if we were have to dwell on this, I, I think we would we would we would dwell on this all day. So, what with this particular situation, what do you think is the way out? And we navigate this um this area and make sure that if we support is not coming from the the local churches. Support is not coming from radio presenters. So, as new independent artists. How do you think we can, um, you, you, you know, we navigate this thing, Lisbeth? Lisbeth, how do you how do you think we can we can do that? If, hmm. if the support is not coming, external support is not coming, how how do you? Think yeah, we can do that? I think we the musicians ourselves could also help, but it, 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 okay. it, it looks as if when we get to the top. You see the way we are ranting? <laughs> when we get to the top, we forget about those coming. Instead of holding their hands, we just forget about them because we have gotten there. So even we, the musicians, ourselves, mm. we don't help ourselves. That could have been the only... Aha! Uh -huh. But you even request for... Uh, send a friend request and they won't mind you. What is she trying to do? Yeah, I'm a star. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a star. Uh, you see, but we don't help well, ourselves. I you mean, know, I met, think, uh, I met, I met, I met, uh, okay. I met one of our sisters, a musician, gospel musician. Okay. At, I'll mention the station, Joy right. Prime. We were all going for interview. You know, she saw me okay. and just passed. I was like, what is happening here? She saw me and just passed. I met another mm. one in Kumasi. Oh, is, it, is, it because, is it because? Is it because? Is it because she doesn't know you at all? Why, why did you think? Why do you think she she ignored you? Is it because she doesn't know you, or she you think she knows you, but she just chose to do that? My dear, even if you don't know someone, courtesy demands that you say hi. 
I'm a lying. But you know, she just passed. Be mm. I'm saying this because when we get there, we think we've got him there. We cannot descend. We can't come down. We are already there. We can't fall again. So we treat those who are coming anyhow. But we forget that no condition is permanent. Wow. As God has done for you, or as God has done it for you, God, the same God will do it for that sister or for that brother. You understand me? Today you are there. Are you telling me that you always be there? No, God is still working. We don't help ourselves. We the mm. musicians. Mm. We don't even love ourselves. Love Talk less ourselves. of helping ourselves. Help ourselves. We don't love. Our, there's love. no love. <laughs> I mean, we, we 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 don't show love. There's so much envy. There's so much hatred. Let me say it as it is. Yeah. yeah. See how the secular yeah, musicians sure. can do their things, and see how we also do our things. They are always organized. Always organized. They know where to go from where. Wow. We are always organized when it comes to us because okay. we're doing it for God. We're doing it, we, we do it anyhow. After all, your reward is in heaven, your reward is not on earth. So, why put in your all? You uh, see, I we think don't help us my out. sister, okay. I saw uh, uh, the Abigail, okay. uh, also for red, uh, sister Abigail, she came online, she wrote something there. She said, You need to produce a quality music. I don't know how she would define her quality mm. music. She should but go and listen to thing, our music. Yes. There is one thing mm -hmm. that I know. Uh, that, you know, Daughters of Glorious Jesus. And uh, let's say Joe Mitchell. Today is his birthday. Happy birthday to him. You know, they started from somewhere. And when they started, I know that the songs that they sang, people thought it was not nice. It's, they thought it was not a quality music, as mm. she's saying now. But as at now, Daughters of Glory, the, the songs that they were sitting singing those years, it's still here, and we are singing it. Because it's time. You get it. You are saying it's not quality. Me, I don't know how she would define a quality. But no, let's admit, you know, let's, when you let's, see let's your admit, sister, let's admit some of us. Mm. They're not, 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 not. Some of us, the songs we produce, mm. it's not good. I understand. How about no. the others who do mm. good music? Mm. It's not all of us. Some of us are doing well. No, I mean that. That's it. Yeah. All right. So mm. let, let let me come in. let me come in here. So, like you rightly said, Lee, Elizabeth, uh, and 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 you as well, um, Cheska. I, I think that I think that um, some some songs are really good, but they don't see the light of day because they don't get the support that is needed. That that one is there, and there is also that part where people don't produce quality mm -hmm. songs, and it is. And you see, sometimes even the people that have gone ahead of us who are big names, it's not all the songs that are produced that are quality, but it's because they are big names. Sure. You know, some of them, when you listen to even the, if you listen to the, the content of the song, you listen to the, it has no scriptural basis and all that kind of thing. But because yeah. they are big and they it's going far, it yeah. point, you know, so I mean, that it's 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 mostly about the initial support to push this. I mean, I know for a fact that you know, God has called you. He is able to um, take you to where he wants to take you and at the right time. But then it does not negate the fact that there is still, it is still a challenge. It is still a challenge for new and upcoming musicians. And it's a huge challenge. I mean, I, I, I interact with a lot of new people and I'm still, I'm somewhere, I'm, I'm still in, I'm in the same base space myself. And it's a challenge to get your music out there. So um, we've talked. We've spoken about quality. Quality shouldn't be compromised for good song to come out. We've spoken about the challenge when it comes to talking about the challenges mm -hmm. when it comes to the church. Now um, let let me find out for 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 family. Okay, how do we think that our family or our um, immediate support systems when it comes to family and friends can help us? Do, do we think there is any way that that can help us? Let me start with Jessica. Let me start with you. 
May. Hello. Yes, I'm asking that. Is there a way that our, our family? Yeah. Hello. Is there is there a way that our family can help us? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, when it comes to family, you know, other as they are saying, it's good or bad. The quality music, what, what, what. But when it comes to family, if you get a family and they know what is in you, even if you don't start well, they can support you with all anger. You know, I me, mean, I have a good family. Mm. For supporting, if it's not even uh, financially, it can be other way around. Praying with you, subscribing, sharing, I mean, telling their friends, doing everything possible that it will come to pass. We are not saying that uh, we don't have people, maybe mm. friends or church members. Would, some of them do. Some like, we, we, we are not saying they don't support us in, but in fact, we, me for particular, it's not enough. As looking at the church I'm in right now, I would say it's not enough. Not saying that they should give me their money or something. But you know, when you see that your sister is getting somewhere, at least you try your best to, I mean, do something to help. Take your little push to help the person. I don't know of others, but uh, that's my, that's what I, I can say. Yeah. Yes, um, yeah. Uh, right, so, um, uh, child, family, <laughs> how, is, how is the support network for you when it comes yes, to family? Yes, please. Um, um, it's good. It's, it's very good. good. But you see, I'm saying something about family. Some of my friends who don't have that kind of family where they don't even have access to them. Okay, so and for me, I have access to them. It's, they are very supportive when it comes to sharing. Even when I'm, I'm having my lunch and, and I'm having a personal program, they will travel from afar and come. They are not with me here in Takade, but they, they can still travel from Sunyane to this place. I mean, that's where they are staying now. So um, the support is really there. You know, if they are not able to come, to send you money, you know, to support, is there. But I want to say, if you don't have that from family, because not everybody is having that kind of family where they have access to them. Your metal like this, you know, um, had to push a lot of um, songs by himself because um, Otien's story now, the, the story of your metal was a little different. Okay. It's so different when it comes to especially finances and the father and all that. It's a new Obiana, Obenya, Bibisa. So if you have it, then it means um, your family is is, is good. It's, it's okay. Yeah. So family support is is very good. I, I, I think that is where we have to even start before we even talk about church. Yeah. Mm. 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 Okay. Let me read some. Let me read some. This I have. Um, Ajua Ama Apia, Minister Ajua Ama Apia, yeah, she, she's, she's also a recording artist and uh, a, a broadcaster as well. Uh, Ajua has a fantastic program that she's debuted on YouTube, Heart to Heart Talk Show. Ajua says that the fact is that the people that you expect to support you are the people that wouldn't support you. <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm sure she's talking from a personal experience. So I'll be very, I'll be, Abigail is back, and Abigail is saying that, oh, I wasn't referring to you guys' music personally, but was just speaking generally to musicians. Abigail, that is well noted. Thank you very much. And I have a lengthy one for Daniel. So Daniel Okan says, all of us should have in mind that the higher God lifts you up, the more humble you should become. I believe if we don't forget this, true. we wouldn't behave in a way that will bring our Christians. Well, I mean that's that that's true, but I, I think yeah. for the for the point that we are on at the moment, I I, I I think that is quite different from um the values of humility and the values of 
of, of progression and that kind of thing. So, uh, Lizzie, I mean, mm -hmm. I know you you are currently um, married. You are a mom, and um, and I know you do you do, you, you receive a lot of support personally from your husband because uh -huh. you, I know he's your manager. But <laughs> for how do how are you how are you combining how are you combining yeah how are you combining family life that is your your immediate nuclear family and then ministry any support from the wider family network. um if i heard you correctly um it's 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 not been that bad because my husband has been extremely supportive wow financially i mean everything when i have to shoot you'll be there with me taking care of the gay my husband has been i mean all the support and with the extended family the little they can do for you is to be sharing be liking your things and all that but the financial support has always come from my husband yeah it's always and 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 let me let me say this mm. okay the church is also mm. a family so. the church is also <laughs> a family okay yeah <laughs> bible says well, we shouldn't neglect the assemblies of the world the brethren the, the church brethren. is also a family so what is our families they mm. are families mm. what are they also doing to help us and how many of our family members, I mean the immediate family members, how many of them can give us what we need to 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 support this project? But the church, as you say, if five cities, five cities, five cities, mm. the church is more than my my immediate family. How many are we? My church, we are over. Don't let me mention it. So if they will ah. give you like five cities, five maybe one city couple. It will go a long way to help you. They are family, mm. so you see, whenever we have to do something for the church, they will make us understand. They will try to convince us that we are a family. But when you have to receive from the church, mm. that one they are giving it to an individual. Oh no, <laughs> shouldn't be mm. so. All right, okay. it's very sad. God will help us. God will help us. Let's let's let's. Uh, we, uh, uh, we, will, we will bring the conversation to a close um, shortly, but let me find out um, the next steps for all of you. So, um, Cheska, let me start with you. You have, is this your first single? This is your first single, Cheska, is it? Yes, please. Yes, please. Yes, it's my okay, first so single. What, what, is, what is the future for you? What are the next steps? What, what, Right. What is the future? What should people? What should your fans expect? Uh, how are you progressing from here? Uh, me, um, thank God, though. But uh, I know I have no limit. It's Cheska to the world. I want to win souls for God all over the world. I don't mind wherever I'm here, like I am right now. But uh, I. I always tell people that they should, I mean, expect something great because with the Holy Spirit with us, he leads us to do everything that we want to do. And uh, uh, it's, it's, it's something that, it's a song that speaks a lot. It has more in it. Mm. And uh, I'm telling everyone that very soon my video will be out and uh, I will not Keep long by bringing the other ones. Yes, that's what uh, I want okay. them to know. All right, ciao. Uh, right. Yes, please. You 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 launched your you launched your album not too long ago. Was that your first album? Yeah. Yes. Was that your first? That, album? That's my first album. Yes, please. Okay. Okay. That was that's your first album. So, so what what is the next steps for you? What what should we expect for you in the short, in the short to medium term? In in the short, <laughs> um, for now I'm I'm in, in the short I'm working on something with. So what what should get? <laughs> I'm I'm working on something with with Koda. So 
um, hopefully it will come soon. Yeah, with Koda so, and, and okay, also right. with LC. So hopefully it will come very soon. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I know, Lizzie, yeah. I know you are cruising on the release of your new single. I've been seeing you do a lot of interviews and um, you know, radio engagements and stuff. But what, what is the what is the next steps? What are we expecting a, an album soon? Where what should we expect from you? Uh, yes, the plan was to um, release maybe a single every six months. That would, that would have been twice okay. in a year. But unfortunately, the COVID. Mm. So we are waiting <laughs> for God to speak. <laughs> we are waiting for God to speak. Okay. When God speaks and everything, the storm, goes away, then we'll know what to do. But for now, we'll hold on with all the things we planned, you know, doing. So that um, when everything is normal, because as you can see, now there are no gigs, there are no shows, they are just pumping and pumping and pumping and pumping. Nothing is coming to support the little that you have invested, mm. you know, nothing. So with this thing, with this one that is already out, we are still, you know, promoting it. We are, but, you know, mm. we are working. We are we are in the studios, mm. you know, recording songs and all that. Mm. When everything is okay. Right. Right. Oh, so come. Right. Let, but let me find out from, from, from the three of you. Um, being said now that we are kind of new normal, the end, although we are hoping that the COVID goes away, but there are there are um, uh, what do you call it extrapolations that thought something that may be happening soon. Things may not get back to the sort of normal that we've known all these years. So for us as as independent upcoming or new gospel musicians what are some of the things you think we can do differently so and that's the emphasis emphasis differently what are some of the things we can do differently just in case that we don't get back to that era where we are having gigs uh, that era where you are being invited and you are being given honorariums and that kind of thing what can we do differently um, let me let me start with you, Charles, and I will come to the lady. Okay, please. Um, uh, I think the first thing I would say is uh, you need to work. Yeah, so that's the first thing you need to do. No matter, uh, many musician crowd here, but I think you just need to do something to at least earn baby bika cra. And then, um, if you want to still continue. You, God is going to calm the storm because you you were still you were still doing what you were doing you you were whether there are gigs or not you still do what you do so um I think we should just go on if we can do these virtual concerts that people are doing we we, we, we can still do it but if only you are able to work eh. If only you are able to work, then it means you don't. You are not expecting anyone to give you anything. You are making impact, and then the little that you can gain from this music uh, music thing we are doing is to um, um, use these digital stores, uh, like the tune call that we talk about. So, I think that one too can give us something small. But if you are you are a start um, a, a start a startup, uh, I think that's the word. Yeah. I will tune call in Sanya Mana. Then yeah, it will take way. a little while because, yeah, <laughs> you take a, 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 it will take a, a little while for you to get that amount of money. Yeah, so I think that basically that's it. But we need to work. Yeah. That one, they have to emphasize on that. We need to work. Yeah. Mm. Right. We we need to work. Um, Cheska, do you do you share the same sentiments? 
Yes, um, even doing the work of God, all anger. If it's your capacity to, I mean, work, if you have something doing, that will make you busy, like not having focus on your ministry. You need to do something so that you will not always be begging people for something. You get it. And uh, I think mm. we need mm. to pray. For now, prayer in our, in our ministry is supposed to increase because we are not in a normal day. So we need to pray mm -hmm. very well because for things to happen. Because getting people to help you, it's by prayer. Getting destiny helpers in your ministry, it's not easy. Because some people will promise you, I'll give you this, I'll give you that. But if you don't pray, it won't come to pass. So I am like, I plead everyone. And if you are a musician and you are not praying, it's something else. You can, like, people can push you, you'll get mm. there. But I tell you, you yourself, you'll bring yourself down. So I pray. Mm -hmm that God should help us, give us his spirit, inject us with prayer. The Holy Spirit should, I mean, help us to pray and stand on our, our knees to pray very well. This time is prayer. And uh, as uh, I saw someone saying that we should humble ourselves. Right. Yes. Mm, as they say, when it comes to musicians, they say we don't humble ourselves. But in, in fact, some, <laughs> the thing that people would do, the person is not, I mean, well known. So, Papa and Kwaka, I don't know how to put it, but Bibi and Kwaka, Bibi and Bibi, but they will forget us. Bibi and Kwaka, Papa, and your credit. Because, because <laughs> you are there, like you are the spotlight. So, they will, I mean, say certain things, but maybe it might right. not be true. So, we should be very careful. Hmm. Just let it go because God knows mm. each and everyone's heart. And I know God will not put us to shame. I know that. Right. So, um, Paul says, let's work. Tesca says, let's pray. Lizzie, what are you saying? How are we adjusting oh. to the new normal? And now the work is prayer, as she said. Uh, we all didn't anticipate right. this. Mm. And it has come. So we wouldn't know what to do now. And while thinking of what to do, I think we should rather go into prayer, seek the face of God, for God to direct us, show us the way. Where should we go from here? Because we all didn't know COVID-19 was coming. And it has come. So now, now that it has come and we didn't plan for it, I think God should just show us the way because we we don't we don't know what to do. As for the virtual concerts, I mean they are there. Who can we end here then? You know what happened? And also, uh, we'll say we'll continue <laughs> to work. We'll continue to work. Right. Don't forget the virus is also out there. If you don't go out, you meet it. Um, going from radio stations okay. to radio stations, um, using their microphones. I was even has, asking my husband, how do they sanitize the microphones? Because it's also a good weapon for COVID-19. Okay. It can easily spread. Uh -huh. right. So um, right. we'll be doing it side by side, but not us the way we should, because mm. if you try... You come out, you come home with a virus. Yes, you come home with a virus. So the conventional mm, concept, so, I mean, everything is on hold. Mm, so mm. why do you want to go? Everything is on hold. So we just have to pray for God to come mm, in or yeah. God to direct us. Maybe go here or go there. But now as we speak, everything is on hold. Institutions, I mean, churches, I mean, everybody is right. not working. Right. So it would it wouldn't be strange if you as a musician too you are not working. It wouldn't be strange. That is what has mm. happened. That is what we all find ourselves in. Uh-huh. Mm. But 
the advantage we have is we have mm. God who mm. we can speak to. So let's speak to God. And God will direct us. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Wow, let's speak to God. And yes, um, we've we've been having this whole session with my guest. I call it the chat with session where we've we've had the opportunity to talk about a lot of different things. Um, and let me say thank you to all of you who have joined us from all around the world, just those who have shared the stream as well. I uh, Ebenezer Boatin, you said you've joined us from Kata Doha. Thank you very much for doing that. And I know some of you have joined from Ghana, some from London, some from the States and, and wherever. Now, I'm going to ask you, ladies and gentlemen, before you go, I want you to, I want you to tell me one unique, one thing. I want those who are listening to us today, one unique thing that they don't know about you. I mean, mm -hmm. uh, we've seen your pictures, we've seen your videos on YouTube and all that, kind of, but... I want you to tell me what is one unique thing that we know about you that you want us to know. And then the second thing will be how can we access your music? So let me start with you. Cheska, let me start with you. What 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 is what is one unique you, thing that we don't know about you? Tell me. You always want to start with me. I hear I'm here for you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> because uh, your name starts with C, so you are in alphabetical order, you are the first. <laughs> I hear you. I hear you. <laughs> Thank God. Uh, what people don't know about me, I really, as I was saying, I really love prayer. Where prayer is, I'm there. Because I know what uh, prayer has done for my life. Although maybe people will see that uh, they him fine, but I know where God picked me and who I am today. Secondly, I I I I always don't want to miss the Holy Spirit. I I wish as I will be singing to people, just singing, when the people will be healed, like those who are dead be raising up, like something. That is what I want. Broken hearted, mm. been released. That is what I want. The level. People know that music can do anything. Just by singing, they will be healed. That is what I mm. want God for him to. That's why I don't want his spirit to leave me. If he will leave like it will take anything from me, you can take, but not the spirit. Yes. So that's what I want people mm. to expect okay. big things from me. I mean, touching lives, people getting healed, those who don't know God get healed. That is my field. Winning souls and saving people, that's helping okay. people mm. to Christ. Okay. Okay, so where can we where can we access your music? Um, uh, now your now. first your single is out. What is the title? How can we yes. get my song title is Umre Beba. Your time will come. Umre, Umre Beba. Beba. Wait, wait, yeah, your time will come. Okay. And uh, okay, uh, okay, say, good. I'm and it's available YouTube. on it's available on YouTube. Yes, YouTube. Just come in the stream. Yes. Just come ministries. Uh, okay. I don't know. I'm now doing the international the thing, as you are aware. The digital yeah. online online distribution. Yes. All right, that's fine. <laughs> that's yes. fine. Yes, that's fine. So I'll that's share fine. it. I'll okay. share it Good. for everyone to know on Facebook. Yes, and I, I'm not in anywhere again. That's all. So uh, your social your social Let media handles on Facebook is just. Yeah, Instagram. Okay. All right. Uh, Facebook, YouTube. And I think, yes, yes. That's where I All right. Am. Okay. All right. Lizzie, let me come to you. Okay. Thank you, Cheska. Lizzie, let me come to you. So one thing that we don't know about you and how we can access your music, your social media, we can follow you as well. Oh, okay. Um, I'm not a prophetess. Um, 
um, God reveals to me everything, everything about me, about people that I know. I see the thing, and if I don't pray about it, good or bad, it will happen. That's the other side of me. Yeah. Mm. Um, okay. I would like to okay. use this opportunity to also thank some people, Shadrach Yosin, uh, Skyweb, Elombini, Nyamiakwa, Albright, all the ded dedicated DJs, uh, my supportive family and friends. I mean, they've been there for me. They've been there for me. They've been there for me. The support is massive. It's been, I mean, it's been very, very, very good. And my song, my song too, you can get it on all the um, digital stores. I mean, online stores, they are there. And um, you, can, you can subscribe to my channel, um, Lizin Tiamwa, on YouTube. My, my social media handle is Lizin Tiamwa, Instagram. And Facebook is also Lizzie Ntiamwa. Twitter, Lizzie Ntiamwa. Um, I would like to thank everybody. Wow. Okay. Um, Charles, let me come to you. Um, so, Charles, tell me, <laughs> what is it that, what is it, one unique thing that we don't know about you? How can we access your song as well? Let me try and. Hello, Charles. Do I still do I have Charles or I've lost him? Okay, it, it's it looks like it looks like I've lost Charles in the moment. But hey, I mean, um, a track of Charles. Uh, what I can say, if I hope he comes back before I round up. But I know that uh, Charles is a graphic designer as well, so you know you can you can check out his work on. On, on on all the social media handles at yeah I've lost Charles I hope he comes on before so you can check out all his social media handles at Echako Charles um and you can also uh, follow him on on YouTube and stuff for for his music like he said he has new okay let me see if I have Charles do I have you back on yeah, yeah. Hello, hello Charles Hi, Charles. Do I have you yes, back on? Yes, please. All ah, right. So tell me in your own words. Yes, please. Yeah. So one, one thing about yourself we don't know. And how can we access your music? Yeah. Did, did you hear me, Charles? Um, Agadan, I think. Yes, I, I heard you. Uh, yeah. So I they know I think that about one, me. Thing, one thing about you. Oh, <laughs> my friend, <laughs> they don't know everything about you because I, I mean, wait, okay, so let me read this. So, Edward Damponsa just said that he just went on YouTube to spy and he mm -hmm. saw this powerful song, Nyami Ye, and the video. Um, great quality, God bless you all. So, for all you may think that everybody knows something about you, but somebody may be watching or may watch the video later, <laughs> don't know anything about you. So, tell us, something. yeah, tell us something unique about you and, and then how we can access your songs. Okay, um, I think people don't know, some don't know I, I play instruments, and uh, some don't know I'm the okay. reserve type. Also, they don't know I can fool, you know, I can really. Make jovial, uh, <laughs> jovial stuff, you know. <laughs> and 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 right. and the last thing is a lot of people don't know I am an artist, not as in artist, but an artist, a graphic designer, a a painter, a, a website designer, and all that. I think people don't know. Uh, I'm sure. Yeah. Okay. And you can access all my music. Right. So how? on YouTube and on all data stores. Yeah. Right, right, right. Go to all data stores. Great one. The, the, Great the name at Trapper Charles is on mm. all of the... Yeah. Great mm -hmm. one. Um, let's... Lisbeth, uh, in Tiamua, and yeah. a track of Charles and Francisca Nia Machesca, I would like to say a very, very, very big thank you for accepting my invitation to come and have a chat with me. And it's been insightful. 
um it's been revealing and it has been hot <laughs> it's been it's been quite hot and uh, god will help yeah god will help us all um i believe that i believe that um whatever god starts he completes bible says that um faithful is he that has called and he would do it and also there's a scripture that says that um uh, he who has begun a good work he is faithful to bring it to completion so i just want to encourage you all mm -hmm. that keep doing what you are doing and uh, you know don't hesitate to call on on me for support and advice and things that i can do to assist for how to push the work that you are doing i'm happy to do that so let's all <laughs> support each other Thank you very, very much for coming on today's session. Okay, so I'm, I'm going to, I'm, I'm going to, um, yeah, yeah. God richly bless you. God richly bless you. So I don't know, just this one, just before you go, do you have any advice? Do you have any advice quickly? That's why I have the two of you here. Do you have any advice for yeah. anyone who is yet to start recording? Do you have any advice for that? Liz? Yeah. You have they any shouldn't advice? be in haste. They shouldn't be in haste. And they should, they should spend more time with God. Because it's God who reveals. Whatever that is ahead of you, if you get to know, it's God who revealed to you before. So they should rather stick to God. They should spend more time with God. They shouldn't, you know, um, fame is good. Money is good. But the focus shouldn't be so much on fame and, 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 and money. Hey, I want to be there. I want to be there. I want to be there. It takes a lot of work, prayerfully. It takes a lot of work to get to wherever you want to get right. to. And they should also work on their lyrics. Some of the gospel, gospel musicians, our lyrics are not biblical. They should make sure that whatever they are coming to feed the public <laughs> is biblical. We don't preach. We preach through, through music. So whatever that is coming out should be biblical. It, will, it should be sanctified. Right. Yes. Yes. And I'm sure God okay. blesses okay. a good work. Great. Charles, what would you say? <laughs> Yeah, and, and, and in Psalms, the Bible said, He that dwells in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. See, um, what, what I would say is they should learn how to dwell in the secret place of the Most High. Um, all, all your humility, all the, the directions and whatever you need from God that you are going to get, it is in that secret place. Okay, so that is what I would say. Um, if, if you are supposed to humble yourself, it is dwelt there. I mean, it is there. You are not going to pass there. You have to stay there. So God now nah, bring you out. And as my, my sister was saying, mm. you shouldn't rush. Okay, you, you, you really need to train yourself. You need mentors to mentor you. Before you, you even think of being writing. Sometimes you can write the songs though, but someone like Koda, you write songs, you give it to Koda and Sometimes you know, just as my sister was saying. But, so um, I think basically that's it. We have to <laughs> we have to dwell. We have to dwell. We really need to dwell in that secret place. And it's it's really going to help help us. So basically that's it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay, all right. Thank you, lady and gentlemen. I, I lost Tesca somewhere in the middle. Let me say a very um, big thank you to you and a happy birthday to Joe Metal. Today is Joe Metal's birthday. Happy birthday to him. I know he has yes, a, yes, a, yes, a yes. Happy birthday to Joe Metal. Happy birthday. And happy birthday. Yeah, and happy birthday to Ninoy as well. Ninoy host for oh, Ninoy, uh, happy birthday on a man sign television. Yeah. Yeah. Has to be more happy <laughs> him as well, and I know that you is yeah. birthday somewhere this wow. month. I'm not sure of the date, so we have quite a lot of birthdays this month. So um, wow. thank you very much. Um, I'm gonna play out at the beginning. I play, I played out the songs from 
Lizzie and Charles. I'm going to play yeah. out this, um, this out with a, new, a song from Sister. So, lady and gentlemen, God richly bless you. So, I will Thank catch you. you later. Okay. Amen. God bless right. you too. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Right. Okay. Thank you. Right. Okay. Uh, right. Let me see. I think just about now that. Um, right. I, I, I missed. Let me see. Yeah. Check. Let me see. Okay. Good. Uh, good. 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 Right. I, oh, oh, hello, Cheska. Can you hear me? Because I think I, I lost you somewhere. Let's finish up with you. Hello. Hello, Cheska. Can you hear me? Hello. Yeah, hello, Cheska. Can you hear me? All right, okay. So we're gonna I'm gonna end right now today's chat with session. God willing, next week, um, Sunday, there will be another edition with some special guests. I've already confirmed um Joshua, uh Joshua Hinkwa to join me and some other ones that will join me. Uh, Cheska, can you hear me? Okay, all right. So thank you much for joining me on today's session of the program. Um, I'm really grateful. Um, I was trying to bring on Cheska before we go, but it looks like we're having a little bit of a challenge doing that. So I will sign off next week. Join me. Christabel, is, God bless you as well. Thank you very much for joining me. God willing, next week, join me for another edition of the Chat with Session with me, Daniel Kwekudatsin. And like I said, don't forget to subscribe to my um, forget to subscribe to my podcast on on iTunes, on Google Play, on Spotify, and it's also available on Mixcloud and um, Sound. Um, what's the word? Uh, it's sound cast or something like that. I'm not too sure. <laughs> right. So uh, you can check me out on Facebook, Instagram, everywhere. Daniel Datsun. Facebook is Daniel Hoku Datsun, and I'm on Twitter as well. And yeah, and also look out for um, our artists or you know development programs for artists that we do have on Zoom. So the growth strategies for new gospel artists. I think on Friday, I was joined by um, my brother Ninoy for us to take people through the practical ways of listing their song on, on, on TuneCore and distributing it in digital stores. And you, you know, Ninoy does an extensive teaching and tutorial on uh, how much we get from the various digital stores and how we can leverage on it. So look out for all these. And the next when the next registration goes out, uh, make sure you are on there. Subscribe to my YouTube channel as well. I will be putting out some materials very, very, very soon. But this is the music from Cheska. She calls this one Wom Rebeba. So. I'm a man of my word. 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 I